Hi, this is Alex with a video demonstrating the new core features within GV Stratus version 4.8 and the supporting tools provided by Grass Valley. In the last release, we added support for scavenge of H.264 proxy using the GV render engine. Version 4.5 provided three standard proxy quality levels, between 1 and 5 megabits per second, with the latter supporting up to 720p HD. Now I can define a custom quality level within the GV Stratus control panel tool. The system supports a wide range of useful screen resolutions between 320x240 right up to 1920x1080. Simply select the resolution value you wish to support for proxy within your system. With a resolution defined, I can select from a range of bitrates applicable to that resolution. We support bitrates up to 13 megabits per second for the highest resolution selectable. Please note that system designs must take into account a higher proxy bitrate to avoid potential issues with the network and proxy storage. Please contact your local Grass Valley specialist if you have questions. Another area we have enhanced in this release is archive support. GV Stratus has supported three major archive vendors for several years. Now we've added a new mechanism, the common RESTful Archive MDI. The new RESTful Archive API allows any vendor who wants to work with GV Stratus to develop an integration against a new standardized set of API calls specific to Archive and Restore. The new API calls will allow Archive, Restore, Partial Archive and Partial Restore from within GV Stratus. We are already working with vendors who wish to add support to their product. For more information, please contact your local Grass Valley specialist. GV Stratus has supported the K2TX Central shared storage solution since Stratus version 4.5. In this latest version, we've made it simpler to define, deploy, and upgrade systems using K2 Central. I can now easily define K2 Central servers and clients within the GV Site Config application, which is used to define devices and deploy or upgrade their software in my system. In a GV Stratus system, my K2 Central storage and clients are now managed within the GV Stratus control panel application so all my configuration is kept within the same user-friendly tool. Finally, we have developed GV Stratus 4.8 against Microsoft.NET 461 and Visual Studio 2015. We require your system and clients to be updated to these latest Microsoft tools in order to upgrade to GV Stratus 4.8. This change keeps us up to date with the latest Microsoft tools and support for key development components. Many thanks for watching. There are more GV Stratus videos on our YouTube channel and I look forward to bringing you more great features soon.